what is up guys Steve here and it is time to start another stream welcome to the channel I am going to get started right away all right I forgot to start with the sharpen all right and get my music going and start the timer I don't think it's too big of a deal that I missed the timer by a few seconds there. All right. Now, as you can see, a little bit different from the previous stream. We've got all the moves. We've got all the stats on screen. The great technicians over in Gamehook, they managed to get everything working again. Although the PP doesn't seem to be right. Oh, actually, no, it might be right. Do we have 30 sharpens and 30 uh, conversions? It might have just been coincidence that I was down to 30, 30, 30. Now, I can't remember what level I battle the rival at. I didn't write it down. I wrote down to start Brock at 14. I know that. But I feel like the rival was much uh, earlier. There, yep, the tackles went up to 35. So yep, that was the right play. I'm curious how low of a level we're actually able to get through that other, uh, the bug trainer, the last one, since I can skip those two. Oh look, you can actually see the, um, the, the defense going up from the Hardens. Now it doesn't do that for Porygon's attack though, when I, whenever I use the Sharpen. Like, let's watch. I'm gonna use a sharpen here. Attack 15. Oh, I also forgot. Okay, well my attack's still 15, but I didn't get poison, so that's good. My speed is lower than the Weedles, as you can see. Yep, okay. All right. Oh yeah, all it has is hard and there's no point. All right, well, time for the grind. Now I wonder, all right, so I have, I can see how many tackles I have now, which is great. Now I'm thinking by the time I get close to that level 14, I should take on the other trainers in the rival to go for a, like a consistent time, probably like level 11 or so that I should consider the rival. It's not really that much of a waste of time. Oh wow, I used two tackles very quickly there. It didn't even have time to update it. Oh, we're down to three, huh? So we can't do a high level Metapod here. All right, Caterpie, that works out. All right, so as you can see, our text file is a little bit behind. It takes a whole second. But, you know, it is definitely better than nothing. As you can see from last stream, we had nothing. Level 9. I can consider walking around now. Ooh, that's a rare Weedle. One hit, nice. And while we're just walking around training, we can go ahead and grab that Pokeball. Save us 200 bucks. Not that we'll really need it. Pikachu. I wonder... Okay, it doesn't do a whole lot of damage. That's good. Alright. Uh, we have a Weedle, so we'll go ahead and start with a conversion. The 
later Pokemon are going to be very strong. So we're going to start with three Sharpens. Taking a break. Why don't... Uh, I am using Game Hook. You can see the, um, the moveset and everything right there. Oh, I think my microphone is a little too close to the uh, to the music. I might be playing it a little too loud. Oh well. Actually, let me fix that. Uh, why is it delayed? Because uh, Scott uses the HTML files, or Scott grabs his stats from the HTML files directly. Mine grabs from text files, and the text files have to take the time between uh, between being uploaded and then resaved. So there's like a whole second gap. Oh, my sound's fine? Okay. I can see the little microphone meter going up and it sounds like it, or it looks like it's not good. Ooh, okay. Well, we got hit by two sand attacks. That's not good. Oh, nice. Okay, I must have did this fight at a really low level last time because that was much easier. Last time I finished at like 1 HP. Alright, so we're done. We're done here in Viridian. We'll continue training up. We need to get to level 14. Uh, so why do I do it different than him? Because I don't know how to do HTML, and he does. Um, so... A way of getting around being smart enough to code in HTML was having them use, export the files to text files. So that way I could have OBS grab the text files. The only reason I even have the, um, the game time, the total game time there, and it, it updates in real time, is because Scott made that temporary, temporary HTML file that everybody was allowed to use. So... Uh, that's the only thing using HTML. The rest is using text files. Alright. Anyways, we need to get to about level 13 and a half here, so Brock will be consistent. I know it's a little bit different than your guys' yellow run, in which you guys, I think, played at level 12. But, uh, Brock's Pokemon are two levels higher. And he uses Bide a little bit more often, and I'm still gonna be too slow. But yeah, um... I imagine in the next few months, I will probably learn HTML, but I mean, I, it, I'm going to be using this setup for a while where everything is about a second behind and there's just nothing I can do about it. So why can't he just give you the file that he uses? Um, so I actually talked to him yesterday about that. Um, he said he does plan on releasing the HTML file that everybody else uh, will be able to use. But right now, it's still too buggy. And uh, also, it's tailored to his setup. So, like, for instance, one of the things that he has in his setup that's different than our setup is, like, you see how I've got, like, the real time at four times speed, game time, all the background stuff, and I changed that out? He actually has all of that for every single Pokemon. All 150. So, the reason why he doesn't have them as separate files, he just has them all as one, one big, col like, one big file, is so that way his HTML can figure out what the first Pokemon is. Like, for instance, I'm using Porygon right now, but if I were to switch to, let's say, Pidgey, um, in my first slot for some reason, the background would change to Pidgey. His, his his uh, accesses his files and changes the background accordingly. So he has like a whole bunch of automatic stuff that I just don't. All right, so save here because this one could be a hang up. We're at level 13. I hope we have enough XP to get to 14 before Brock. Uh, sharpen, I think I want two. I didn't write it down for every trainer. Okay, it looks like two is pretty good. Two is not enough for the sand true, it looks like. We're about one potion range. Unfortunately, we didn't get to 14. I'll try it. I'll try it at 13. 
too many bells and whistles. Right, right. You know, I... I try... Yeah, that's it. I try. I just... I try to be as informative as possible. I don't... I don't say it's better than anybody's. Definitely not. I just try to have as much... See, I think level 14 is the point where I can do a little bit extra damage. But anyways, uh... The more information that I have for other people to see... Like, look at this. The Geodude has got 120 defense. Like, that stuff's just really cool. Like, I'd really love for the viewer to see that kind of stuff. Now, of course, you can't see my sharpens. For some reason, it updates the enemies, uh, like, boosting moves, but it doesn't update my boosting moves. Alright, I only have 13, 13 uh, tackles left. So... If we get hit by a bide, it could be game. Uh, we got hit by one bide. Unleash energy. Alright. Okay, this might be close. I might be able to do this at one level lower than usual. Okay. I wrote minimum level 14, but I guess 13 is doable. But I just love, I love statistics. Statistics are my thing. And it, it seems like Scott really likes statistics, too, because I can tell that he tries to make all these statistics available to people as well. All right, so nine, uh, three. Oh, I forgot to pick the antidote up in the, uh, in the tree. Well, I guess we're just going to hope we're not going to get paralyzed too much. All right. We're going to do this so we don't have to battle Brock again. And the Porygon. Yeah, yeah, I know uh, you guys went to Porygon. At, or I know you guys went at level 12. I even mentioned at the start of the Brock battle. But the thing is, uh, Brock is two levels higher in this game. And also, oh, I forgot to convert to poison type. That sucks. All right, well, there goes one of my antidotes. But yeah, so because uh, the... The Geodude has got poison powder. Or not po <laughs> Because the uh they're two levels higher. Alright, hold on. Because they're two levels higher, uh, and the Geodude has defense curl, uh, I might run out of tackles. Okay, so I actually have to change to the Weedle here so I don't get poisoned. Alright. And then it also makes the poison sting go down significantly. Oh, I just saw my attack change. I'm curious if that was just a glitch. Because, like, the statistics glitch every now and again. Like, they'll just turn off for no reason. All right. I, I should be talking to that guy, like, without having him walk. I mean, I know you mentioned it doesn't really matter at four times speed, but it's just one of those things that if you get in the habit of doing it, it will eventually make things better in the long run. All right, for some reason, it took, like, six Pokeballs or what? Oh, crap, they're too low level. Crap. It takes, like, six Pokeballs for me to catch this. Uh, I don't remember. I should pay attention more when I know my opponents have, uh, statistic moves. Because I don't think it updates in real time, but maybe it does. Oh my god! It's the first time in one of my Porygon runs where there's a Paris. Can I actually catch it? Nice. Awesome. So, the actual badge boosts themselves are never reflected. So, I don't know if you remember, we were doing the Parasex stream. And when we were at Koga, I pointed out that uh, we were slower than his Venonat. And somehow we were able to outspeed. Not Koga. Um, it was a different one. It was after Koga. Um, we were able to outspeed. Apparently, Scott had mentioned in his Porygon video that the stat statistics do update, but they update based on what the um, Pokemon menu says. 
So the Pokemon menu doesn't tell you about the 12.5% boost to your speed. So you actually have to do the math in your head. Yeah, I know I didn't heal at the Poke Center. I, I think I should have enough tackles to get through. Because you also got to remember, I'm not facing Jesse and James. I'm just facing a guy who I think has like Zubat and Voltorb. Something like that. I think it's Muck and Coughing. And then this Rattata person. Okay, so a 30 attack. See, I used another Sharp in there. It did not change. Also, uh, I spent too much time setting up there. I need to use a potion. Probably two. Yeah, I'm also going to get rid of the um, the thing where I changed the, the dome and helix fossils every time based on a coin flip. Because I just don't have time to do the coin flip. So I'm probably just going to take the helix because Scott takes the dome. And, you know, be a little bit different. Also, I think helix is a tiny bit faster. Oh, for sec... I, I, for, I was thinking, oh, well, I got to get sand true. Better not head to the Poke Center immediately like I usually do. Okay. Uh, so I have it written here that I do Rival 2 first. I should have saved closer to the Rival. That was stupid. So the strategy here is literally just hit the Pidgeotto and set up on the Abra. Looks like it's probably not going to go well. It didn't. Oh well. That's one. Should have. Oh my god. On the bright side, I did forget to grab the rare candy here, so I get a chance to resave. All right. Yep. Uh, have a good stream, man. Yeah, so there's no chance of ever outspeeding this Pidgeotto. It's got 33 speed to my 26. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, well, we just have to get lucky. Nope. All right. Two resets it is. On the bright side, I don't have to be entertaining anymore. <laughs> oh, we got a crit. And despite all those sand attacks. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oof, we're getting all that sand attack luck right here. Five misses in a row. All right. Come on, please, 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 please. Yes! All right. It's a good thing we got the hidden, too, because burn reduces your attack by 50%. That could be a real problem. All right, well, I forgot to say before that guy, so hopefully we just don't black out on this guy. Please don't have Weedle. He has Weedle. Okay. Well, we gotta start with conversion then. So... Oh, we got a crit. Okay. Yeah, I think we needed one sharpen because this Nidoran wasn't... Uh, wasn't a consistent two shot. Now, I did black out on that Mankey one time, and I definitely will consider 
I'll save attack. I will definitely consider saving before the Mankey again because I don't want to have to battle those four trainers. Now, this time we don't have the potions, so we... Alright, hold on. Oof. Alright. Good thing I saved. Alright, we did not need to set up Sharpen at all. Got it. Okay. Zubat probably is still to hit. Alright, well, we're definitely not going to be able to beat the uh, Machop Geodude guy. Whatever damage the Machop Geodude guy does to us, we're probably just going to have to potion away. I probably save too often as well. Yeah, last time I set up on the Machop and it really hurt. This time we're just gonna one, two, three, four, five, six. Just gonna set up on the Geodude. I think we'll take less damage this way. Although it appears we'll be using more PP this way. Alright, so this is the chick with the two Nidorans. The second Nidoran uh, is a three hit, so we set up one of one sharpen. Yeah, I learned that last time. This dude, I think, is actually pretty bad. He's got like a I want to say a Nidoran and a... No, no, a Rattata and a Zubat. Something like that. Ekans. Alright. Alright, well... Again, like I said, I'm going to try and be more cautious this run. It doesn't really hurt to save. One, two... All right, I hope two is enough to hit the Pidgey. Yep, all right, good. Level 23, we get a uh, Psybeam, which I don't actually think helps too much, but it doesn't appear that we're gonna get to 23 before Misty. But we're making good time. Make definitely good time. Well, good time for me. Also, forgot to escape rope there. That definitely will hurt the time. Now we're going to have this extra escape rope on me, which is going to suck. She doesn't actually have a water move on this Goldeen. Oh, it's still not a two hit, huh? Luckily, it used some tail whips. Alright, so I remember setting up really sucks because of the X defense. Like, if she uses X defense, setting up really just doesn't go well. Now, this is the first time we faced Staryu and it didn't get a crit at some point. That's good. Usually, Staryu crits quite often. Ooh, she started with an X defend this time. That's usually pretty good for me. Psybeam, nice. Alright. So, interestingly enough, I learned that there is a strategy where I save my TMs for way later and teach them later. I mean, <laughs> there's not much to the strategy. I'm not going to move the Psybeam because we're not going to use it for a little while. 
Ooh, did I grab the, the other by the lass? I don't know if I did. If I didn't grab the other, then I probably want to use the elixir, the extra elixir I always manage to get. I find these ones to be quite difficult as well. All right. I forget how many sharpens we're supposed to set up, but getting hit by a sand attack never helps. Ooh, good. Nice one shot. Okay. Okay. We get to actually learn here uh, just how strong. All right. Let's take a look. Radicate has got lower. 26, 23. He's got lower special. Okay. This time we're not going to sell dig. We're actually just going to go ahead and teach it now then. Before I forget. I sold dig last time and that was a major mistake. Alright, so we don't need body slam or anything. It's just straight to the rival. Oh, okay, well. We're going to be a little bit low on HP. I I was supposed to hit the shop so I can get a super potion. Alright. I think I write that I want to do one sharpen. And then just tackle all the way through. Yep. I'm trying to do most of the run off of memory. Charmeleon's got higher special, it looks like. Thank God he used bad attacks. Alright, so we need to make sure to hit the Mart. Get some super potions, get rid of the pokeballs. Alright, so buy three super potions. Buy four repels. Sell our pokeballs. Sell our escape rope. Our nugget. Thunder wave. Uh, bubble beam. Full restore. Perfect. That went very well. Mm. Well, that didn't. Nope. Oh. Whew. All right. So I get to pause the time there and make a save state. Because it hurts the time to do the trash can puzzle. All right. So we got the first one there. And the second one, okay, it's right there. All right, so load that, go straight to the answer. Oh, it said reset, okay, well. Does it go straight to the top left? I hate it when it does, when it goes straight to the top left. Nope. Oh, no, that was the answer. I'm just blind. Okay. So I get to save. Oh, wait, no, I get to, to load, then do the answer real fast, then save. Nope. All right. Wait, that wasn't the answer? There was just trap. What? Okay. Well. All right. We're going to save after doing this first one here then. Okay. I didn't know this could happen.
All right. All right. Okay. Let me just... I want to turn the music down just a smidge. There we go. All right. Now we can turn the game back on. I also realized we didn't super potion before. All right. Now we save. All right. Turn the... There. Timer's back on. Everything is all good again. All right. Conversion. All right. Side beam. For some reason, my brain is like, that's going to take it out in two hits. You should use side beam. All right. The regular defense is much worse on Pikachu. All right. And I guess now that we're electric type, Ooh, that sucks. Okay. Yeah, our attack stat was lowered quite a few times with Growl. Sweet, sweet. Got that badge. All right. All right, now we get to do this skip, which is really useful. All right, back here. Now we head down here, grab the bike. Oh, I thought that normally just defaults on cut. Save, because we don't want to have to go back all the way to surge again if something crazy happens. Psy beam because it should be all one shots because they're all poison type as you can see in the top right they are all poison type yeah I'm not crazy for some reason I tackled them last run that was real stupid all right these are also bug poi Ooh. okay bug poison bug poison Okay. Good, good, good. We don't heal. Okay. For some reason, my brain tries to get some extra steps in before the other. All right. Repel at the top. Antidote, second from the top. Super potion, third. All right. Okay, we don't actually need Super Potion, we just need the Repel. Alright. Save. We have a decent amount of PP. Probably should have considered a one... Uh, ooh, that was a lot of damage we just took. Alright. Okay, still making good time. All right, this time let's go ahead and set up two sharpens. Okay, that turns it into a three hit rather than a five hit. I guess that's pretty good. All right, these are bug poison. Or grass poison. All right, antidote I think is... oh. Recovery. All right, we don't need conversion anymore. Antidote. Repel wore off. All right, exploding hiker. <sighs> I'm just glad I got my save off. Mhm. Mm All 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, that one expected. Repel wore off. Straight down, all the way around. Nice, bug poison. Ooh, that was a crit, okay. Don't need the uh, max ether there. I never seem to find a place to use it. All right, saving. I don't actually anticipate having a problem, but shenanigans do happen when you're low in HP. All right, not bad, pretty good. So this time we're definitely gonna do Erica first. We have two side beams left, so we're gonna wanna save before getting to her gym. Hope I haven't actually tested the whole gym doing the Erica strat. So I don't know how much uh, Psy Beam is going to be a downgrade over Psychic. We're just going to have to find out. So far, not one-shotting, so that's bad. Ooh, hit by a wrap. All right. Might have to end up buying some stuff. Okay. Alright, level 30. I forget what our next level up move is. I think it's at like in the 30s somewhere. 35. Okay, we got hit by a leech seed. So we're down to s seven psi beams. Oh, stun spore. Oh, I should have used tackle. All right, four side beams, hopefully enough. Ooh, nice crit, all right. All right, there we go. Use another Paralyze Heal. That other. I did not end up picking up the other. Okay, that's fine. Fingers crossed. Starting off with Sleep Powder, not great start. Alrighty then. There's one reset. Good thing I saved before her. Alright. Hopefully things go a little bit different. Unfortunately we're starting with a wrap, but we didn't go to sleep, so there's that. Alright. Well, it appears that Victory Bell is going to be a real problem without Psychic. just faster than me. Oh, this is a good run. This is a good run. Actually, I have a good chance to hit recover there. 
All right, fingers crossed. Uh, she's got 38 speed. We have 46. Bioplume's a lot slower than I expected. We can't dig out of here, right? Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay. All right, well, we have a few extra items to buy than our normal stuff. First, let's heal. I don't know why I click B too early all the time. All right, one, two, three, grab that. All right, we want fresh water. We want lemonade. Grab both. Sell. All right, so we want sell our uh, thun. No, we want to keep thunderbolt, of course. Nugget. I don't remember what twenty. Oh, eighteen is counter. That one's mega drain. Twenty one is mega drain. All right. Now we can afford to buy three carbos. Use the three carbos. All right. Oh, wait, we need to buy Poke Dolls on that floor. Two Poke Dolls. Yeah, we need Mimic. I Wait, actually, I don't remember if we need Mimic. Buy, let's go ahead and four Super Potions. Uh, six Super Repels. And three Antidotes. So many extra clicks. All right. Now we say your teach. Spiro, fly. Fly to Lavender. You hit up the rival. Save. Alright, I don't remember the strategy here, but I imagine it's pretty similar. Ooh, we didn't get hit by anything that time. That's good. Alright, sharpen. It only knows barrage and hypnosis. That's pretty good. Three. Four. Ooh, I got a crit. Alright, come on. Five. Six. All right. We're now ready. Oh, we leveled up, of course. But we still have the sharpens, so there's that. Sweet. All right, we need to use a super repel. Alright, Psybeam. Embrace the Pori, become gone. <laughs> we're we're getting there. This is my best run by far. Like a large margin best run. I mean, I've made plenty of mistakes. I mean, no by far not like a perfect run by any means, but pretty good run considering all the mistakes I've made in the past. Oh, so close, but it hit itself. Nice. All right. I think we grabbed the bike. I'm trying to think ahead. What do we do after this? I'm pretty sure I grabbed the bike. All right, grab our Poke Doll. Bye bye. 
save here. I don't know why, but I, for some reason, always have a difficult time with one of these rockets at some point. Alright, poison flying. Weak, it's weak to psychic or er, psi beam. Oh, see, you know, just sometimes maybe it's a confusion spam right there that might do you in. All right, another poison. Oh, and sometimes you just make those kind of mistakes right there. All right, we're, we're learning agility. Normally I teach it over uh, recover, but today we're going to teach it over sharpen. All right, there's that. Okay, that was a little closer than I expected. All right, got our pokey flute. Now a little strategy I picked up. Yep. You can head over here, grab swift. Right. Now that we have Swift, we can teach Swift over Tackle. All right, that will deal with uh, some of the like the the annoying things that Koga does with the spam uh, poison or like smoke screen spam. All right, we're gonna save here we're gonna go put slow speed on <sighs> come on come on there we are rare candy come on all right I know it's around here. Oh, it was. There it is. Okay. Perfect. Ooh, I almost battled that guy. That was close. Alright, now we're heading directly to the safari zone. Alright. Super repel. Carbos. Now, I'm not sure if we'll have enough room for the protein. Alright, we want the last regular repel, so that uses up a space in our inventory slot. So now we can definitely afford the protein. I'm just going to go ahead and use them now. I'm saving the PP up for Psychic, but only once we finally make it to Saffron. Alright, we got that. Now we can dig. Okay. Um, oh, I know exactly what I want to do from here. Cut. Alright, grab that. Crap, he's gonna he's gonna walk around me, which is gonna be slow. Yep, see, a little bit slower to walk around, but that's alright. Alright, grab this PP up. Alright, so now we officially have all the PP ups. Alright. Now we can go walk over to Saffron. Oh my god, I didn't buy the extra. There's always something. There's always something you forget. Can't 
Can't be perfect. Always something. That was my best run yet. All right. Come on. Come on. Glug, glug, glug. All right. Now we need Psychic. All right. We're going to go ahead and fly over to Fuchsia. Um, going to hit this guy up. Uh, we're going to agility. One, two. Ooh, that could have been bad. Three. Okay. Please one shot. Yes. All right. Antidote. I know we bought one. There we are. All right. There's one more guy. He actually has ended runs before, so I'm going to save. Five resets is so good. I mean, it's not actually good, good, but I mean, it's pretty good for a third attempt. All right. Side beam was disabled. We weren't going to use it anyways. Thank you. Thank you. Just thank you. Freebies. Freebies all around. Did not level up, though. All right. Uh, this is when I'm going to go ahead and teach Psychic. Over Psybeam. Go ahead and use our three PP ups. Psychic. 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 All right. Uh, Super Potion. Where are you? There we are. All right. Save. All right. We're severely underleveled for Koga. So if we lose real quick, I'm just going to quit. One, two, three. Oh, we got poison. Okay. Oh, we leveled up. Okay, well, next run we're going to do agility on Muck then, I guess. Oh, it lived. Okay. For some reason, my... Alright, come on. Come on. No, not sludge. No, come on, come on. No, you're supposed to use self-destruct, gosh darn it. Before the X attack. Ah, well. No, that one's doable. That's very doable. We can do this. You can't X attack me. That sucks. All right. So. All right. Swift. Okay. Level up. Agility. All right. Agility. Agility. And actually, we're just going to go ahead and swift the muck since it has minimize. Every time it uses minimize, it's irrelevant. Alright. Oh, useless X attack. Nice. Ooh, we got a miss. All right, well, we're just going to Psychic. Sweet. We beat Koga really low level. Very low level. Now we're Poison. All right. Hand him his teeth. All right. Get Strength. Paris doesn't learn strength. Okay, well, we're going to head over to the rival then. Crap. I know we've been to Saffron. Come on, there we are. All right, because we're going to dig out of the Sylphco building, we want to make sure to heal there. All right, two, three, four, five. All 
Alright, this guy is simple enough with a psychic. Oh, okay. Card key. Alright, grab this protein. Okay. Don't need toxic. Uh, crap. We actually need most of this stuff. Okay. Alright, we're on five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Take this guy out. I believe he just has a mod chop and a mod choke. Okay, just a mod choke. Simple enough. All right, we get a carbos. We want that rare candy. We still have one spot in our inventory. Oh, we're gonna fight this guy because, okay, we're gonna fight this guy. Sure, we're going to have to now use a super potion on the rival. Eight, seven, six, five. All right. All right, this is where I teach Thunderbolt. Oh, yeah, I usually teach it over. Okay. <sighs> Alright. I usually teach it over. Alright, actually, we're going to try it without Thunderbolt. Just want to see how it goes. Because normally I get rid of. Uh, get rid of Recover. Ah, oh, darn. Did I just level up? Yeah, I probably leveled up. Yeah, Execute has such a low special. I really like Thunderbolt though. Two psychics? Ooh, that's not going to be enough for the uh, Giovanni when I get to him. Heck, it's probably not even going to be enough for the Gyarados. Right, it's not. Okay. I do not think I can do that without... Okay, we're just going to get rid of Swift. Yes, so we're going to go ahead and teach Thunderbolt over swift see how that goes now I won't have swift for Kadabra but we'll see if it makes that much of a difference so we're gonna level up here now we set up our badge boost one two three all right We do not do much damage. That sucks. And poison leech seed really sucks. <laughs> Alright. Gyarados, Thunderbolt. Simple enough. Alakazam, probably want to recover. Oh nice, he did his own recover. Oh, that was so low. That was so, so low. Oh, uh, we're doomed. Alright. I don't like Recover Strat. Recover seems bad. I like my old Strat. I've just wasted four resets. I really didn't need to. My old Strat. Get rid of Recover. Alright, 
Thunderbolt. Although I should have healed now that I got rid of recover. Agility. Two. Three. Hmm, we're seated now. Oh, wow, that was way too close. But we did it, first try. Uh, we are burned, though. So we're going to have to go through Giovanni. I just used a super repel because I thought it was a super potion like an idiot. Reading for the win. I'm starting to think I don't even like that Paris. I like being able to have strength earlier. How many moves I got? Okay. Well, that sucks. How far back do I go? Did I save? God, I, I hate. I hate. I just hate. <sighs> I absolutely murdered my time. Right here. I always do it at the Rival. I never save after this guy. I never save after Rival 5. Two. Three. Well, at least he set up three Reflex. No Leech Seed, please. Nice. Alright. Okay. Actually, poison's a lot better than burn. Cause now, now our reflect, or uh, not reflect, our swift will still do a lot of damage. All right, forgot to save again. Ooh, a nice crit. Sweet, that went well. Antidote. Super potion. Save. I mean, it's still not the worst. We're at one hour. That's not too bad. Now, I am probably going to end up being... Uh, oh my god. Look how low that special is on Kangaskhan. I never knew that. Okay. So now we dig. Uh, save. Grab Mimic, or heal, not save. All right, do the Fighting Dojo, because we're right here. Um, we're not really using uh, Psychic for Sabrina's gym, so we can just kind of free freely go about this training here. Oh, try attack. I always forgot about that. Um, we actually have a try attack TM, so we don't need it. All right. Oh, it survived. Good for you. All right. All 
Level 43. Alright. Top, bottom, bottom. Alright. We just leveled up recently, so I should be able to set up some agilities. Nice. Nice. Okay. Uh, three agilities I can ho Oh, nice, nice, nice. We outsped. Perfect. All right. And this will definitely save us some time. We can dig out of here. Oh, I already have the sir or TM. All right, HM. Nope. Now surf. Strength. We're using strength more often, so I want it first. All right, so now that we've beat all of those, we're going to be heading to Blaine. First, let's get another heal in because we're actually quite low. Crap. All right, I typically like to grab these. I don't think they're that much of a waste of time. Although they could be a waste of repels. Crap, I just used another repel. Alright, well, we have to hit up a repel on the way out of this town. Alright, uh, was this, this is Blizzard, we want this. We're actually not going to have enough room for, crap. <sighs> We're not going to have enough room. Oh, well, we just used our last repel, so now we're going to have enough room, but at the cost. <laughs> All right. Oh, we didn't see. Okay. We didn't. All right. It's fine. At this point, I've wasted enough time. I can do this. Helix. SSN. Cut. Bicycle. Pokey flute. Fly. Surf. HMO4, card key. All right, that's probably it. All right, make sure I get those extra repels for later. All right. Yes. All right, three no's. Right. Yeah, yeah, repel war off. Okay. This is yes. And this is no. Alright, save. Oh crap. Well, I accidentally clicked B early, so we need to win. Oh boy, do we need to win.
That was a crit. Oh no. <laughs> no. When I realized I forgot to save, I just did that. I know it's cheating, but I am not redoing that whole thing. I have done that so many times. And I'm not even using this run on YouTube, so... It is just practice after all. Oh my god. See how much damage that did? Wow. Oh wait, I do have to click the reset button twice after one, two, or well once because I did technically count it earlier. Swift is actually lower damage. Uh, I'm curious. Okay. Same defense as special defense. Okay. Okay. Alright. All's fair in love and war. I'd need to count another reset. Okay. I've disappointed my own self. I'm also thinking maybe I should consider the sharpen strategy. I don't actually seem to like agility that much. Oh, I am so... Oh my god. What am I doing? I mean, right, look at that, 37 special. 37, that's nothing. Also, the weakness, well, not really weakness, I think it's one times, but still. Also, I think I'm still under leveled again. I cannot seem to find a strategy where I come in here not under leveled. Look at 53 regular defense. I should just know these kind of things. And he's pretty tanky on both ends. Ooh, nice. Level up right there. Right at the end of Giovanni. I could probably use my rare candies early. I will do that. One. Two. Let's try that. 51. Alright, and then lower special, but we have Thunderbolt, so... Alright. Execute is just so weird. I'll never understand the little guy. Wow, Alakazam survived. That's crazy. Uh, 
All right. All right. So we're at 52. We just evolved, or we just got to 52 right before Charizard there. I wrote that the league is consistent at 53. All right, I'm constantly hitting that island. All right. Sweet. Max Repel. Boulder. I don't actually think I'm going to need the Rare Candy here, but I'm going to get it anyways. You would not believe how often I accidentally push that boulder off. One extra spot. I love how you can't really screw that boulder up. The only thing you can screw up is going through that ladder there, which I did last time. really close so close all right we've done it I forgot to heal again all right we've done it we've made it to the league four full restores save Okay, guys, let's do this. Set up on Dugong. Wow, that was a lot of misses. I wonder if we'll level up. Yep. I had a feeling. Jinx is really scary when there's a chance that it can use Ice Punch. Oh yeah, we have one less full restore, or one less elixir, thanks to last time when we... Alright, hold on. Wow, it survived. Oh, right. I'm supposed to... Uh... Oh, well. Look at that special. Just so low. So low. Wow, that was... I'm not going to lie. That was... That was... That was dangerous right there. We could lose right here if Machamp were to use an attacking move. Good job, Bruno. You had, you had a shot. You done screwed it up. Alright, and we need... Just save. Oh, was I supposed to rare candy before this? I guess we're about to find out. Well, this is worst case scenario. One, two, three... Okay, good super potion. Well, that's unfortunate. All right, reset. 
I think we're supposed to rare candy. I should take a look at my Agatha notes. All right. One, two, three. I just wrote three agility minimum. I didn't write a level. So we just spam psychic and we hope we win. That's the strat. Oh, we were so close. All right. One. Okay. Two. Oh, wait, we can get hit by Haze. We definitely do not want that. Okay, there we go. Set up our third. All right. Now, just fingers crossed. I forgot about Haze entirely. Oh, we leveled up right there at the end, too. Sweet. I'm probably not supposed to set up on the Gyarados. I was supposed to teach Ice Beam. Well, this one's dead. I have it in my notes. Teach Ice Beam. I guess we're just going to play that one out until we lose. And now I teach Blizzard, not Ice Beam. Alright, Psychic's been good to us, but it's done. Oh nice, he hit us with a Leer. Probably exactly what we needed. We might even go through this without taking a hit. Unless we miss, of course. Wow! Wow, we just missed all of our blizzards. All right, well, fingers crossed on Dragonite. Flying dra oh, wow. Okay. <sighs> I'm still gonna try. If we lose again. If we lose again, we'll go Ice Beam. I don't know why we missed so much last time. It has 90% accuracy, which is pretty good. I mean, with five blizzards, you have one blizzard to spare, typically. Wow, I'm still... Okay. So I do, I do want to just go with Ice Beam. Also, I think I'm supposed to set up a little bit. Uh, yeah, I think I'm supposed to set up. One, two. Yeah, I think because Gyarados was not ever able or was never able to kill me, I was supposed to set up on Gyarados so that way I could one shot the rest of the team with Blizzard. Now, of course, because I'm using Ice Beam, I might not one shot them all. Okay. All right, I have it written down that level 58 is consistent. Did I save? I think I saved. All right, we'll see how consistent it is. All right, agility. One, two, 
three. Pretty good luck there. All right, Alakazam, Swift. We don't have Tri, tri Beam. I think Tri Beam probably would have been able to one shot there. Oh, we leveled up. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure if we'll even have been able to survive that. I also don't remember which TM. Try attack. There we are. All right. One, two, three. Okay. Okay, so try, oh, uh, well, it was a crit. So again, we leveled up there. It's not, oh, we got a crit, okay. All right. Oh, 124. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we made it significantly faster in game time. Um, so it was like 5.0... I want to say it was like 5.10 or 5.01 yesterday. We just got 4.46 and 1.24 real time. And it was like 1.37 real time. You know, that's not too shabby. I, I think one more run. One more run will do it. Um, now the problem is if I do one more run, if I change up my strategy, it might become less consistent. Because I'm thinking I don't actually like agility that much. I wonder if sharpens just that much better. Hmm. Oh, well. I'm going to hang out in uh, Van Man stream for just a little while, especially while I reset the, uh, the emulator here because I have to reset it back all the way to um, the first Pokemon, change the DVs and all of that. Uh, and while I do that, I'm going to hang out with Van Man. So I will be back again in like, I don't know, 30 minutes. All right. See you guys in 30 minutes. Bye.